gang, 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 what up, man? What's up, man? How y'all feeling and living, man? Early, top of the top of the day, man. I thank God I'm blessed and I'm alive. I thank God for the shorties. Me and the kids alive. I thank God for my parents always. I thank God for my wife, my beloved wife. And I thank God for y'all, man. I really do. I thank God for y'all because shit, without y'all, I would be be. I couldn't be here right now if it wasn't for y'all, so. Hit that like button, man. And let's get into it, man. Dirky yo, dirky yo, dirky yo. How in the hell Dirk beat them five charges, man? Fit time is a motherfucker, but he got it. Fit time. And like what they do, just drop them? They just drop them, right? I don't know. I'm, a, I'm looking on answers from the crowd, like, man. Because I ain't never seen that operate like that, guy. I didn't shout out to the people I fucks with, man, that fucks with me, gang. Hey, all the motherfuckers I was in your inbox, I was in your inbox. Trust me, I was in your inbox. Go check it out. And if I hit the wrong inbox, I apologize. I'm going to have to redouble back, you feel me? But I was in there, man. Um, and everybody who probably commented and responded, uh, you know, shout out to you too. I have to get back to y'all, man. Man, I know the devil is at work, right? The devil is at work. When I say the devil at work, gang, yeah, he attacked in the worstest ways. Um, but you got to have that armor on. They said you gotta have your armor on from head to toe so you can dodge the attacks. Um, yeah, man, I'm talking about taxes dodged. I be out the way on, and I just pray on it, and I pray let God handle the rest. And as far as outside the world, I, I, as far as outside my little world go, I be watching and paying attention out there in the street, man. And I think people, you know, it's a lot of people who dislike when I pay that much attention, but I gotta pay attention, dog. I got to. I'm a blogger for that purpose, so. Um, and I don't think God gave me these skills and this knowledge not to. So I be paying attention. I be watching. Right now we in a spiritual battle, gang. It's a spiritual battle. It's a spiritual warfare. You feel me? You got people around you that'll tell you you crazy, you psycho, and all that extra dumb ass shit. Man, it's a spiritual warfare. I don't think everybody understand that spiritual meaning. Meaning that it's a devil, a demon, my nigga, who only wants your soul. Fuck your flesh. This right here, we're gonna be out of this. This little body, this little piece of meat. We gotta die out of this one day, man. Your soul still gotta live. Yeah, your soul still gotta live. You feel me? And if you a psycho motherfucker, you don't know nothing about that. If you a God fearing person, you know the Lord. Yeah, you know all about that. You know about them souls. You know about them demon souls. You know about them evil souls. You know about them great souls, the angels. I'm just saying. I be telling my kids this. I try to put them up on it. Cause look, when I was a shorty coming up in the foster home, the foster home put the put the church on us. The, the foster system taught us the church life, man. And you know, it was Mr. Crawford I'm sitting there going to church with. We getting pinched on Wednesday nights because we couldn't stay up listening to the pastor. And one time I did stay up listening to the pastor, dog. He said some scary shit. I think he was reading that revelation. What's going to happen at the end of the world and shit like that. So when he reading that, I'm looking, I'm listening. I'm like, it became interesting. I ain't going to lie. And then that started becoming the truth. Because half of the stuff that he was reading from this book has started to come true. And I'm like, wow. I said, well, you know, I want to know myself. Like, who is God? Who is this God, man? <clears throat> when you dig deep, you do find out, right? But you got to be willing to find out. You got to be willing to have him on your side. He on your team. Trust me, he on your team. He on my team. He on my team, man. That's why I be like, man, it's hard to lose. You can't lose with a man like that on your team. Who gonna go against him and who can beat him? Can't nobody overturn what he do. Can't nobody stop what he got coming. That's just that. That's the realness of it. So, you know, I try to put that in my kids head. Like, yo, look, check this out. Check that out. And, and you know, I mean, what more can we say? That's the truth. Like this, though, when you get in situations, you always know you got to pray, man. You got to stay prayed up and stay humble. When you get in situations, stay prayed up and stay humble no matter what. In your ups and downs moments. Like... I could be in one of the toughest situations. You would never know because I'm going to stay prayed up. I'm going to stay humble. I'm going to stay myself. That's the thing, too. So, with that being said, man, you know, I learned to, uh, I learned to uh, jump around those type of obstacles, gang. I learned to jump around those type of obstacles. I learned to dodge certain shit like that. Trust me, there's people out there like that, too, man. You got the people out there, they just weaken. They want the weakness for you. They don't, you know what I'm saying? They're not out there for your best interest. You got the people out there who are praying on your downfall. They can't wait till you fall. But at the end of the day, gang, you got to have that shield on, that armor. On my mama, and they going to see your shield, and they going to be trying to bust through that bitch. But it's impossible. Then you got some out there who act like they riding with the man, but they ain't riding with God. He already know it. They just faking. They floss. Man, they floss flagging. They fake. He know it, though. He can see it. So right away, he go, huh, huh, huh. he cutting shit down like that. Trust me, nigga. When I say trust me, trust me, because... 
The world evil right now is evil is trying to outdo good. Evil is trying to outwin gang. Trust me, if you look around, you, you got evilness everywhere. Have a seat. A seat. You got evilness everywhere. You got disrespectful kids everywhere. You got disrespectful people everywhere. It's, it's less that you got respect for people. It's less that you got people around you like, hey, you know, I was thinking about you. Is you okay? Is you all right? You need anything? You need help with something? Where's those type of people at, gang? We, look, last time I ran into one of them was, um, it's been a while. It's been a while, man. I ain't gonna lie. I be helping the shit out of people too, but sometimes you gotta learn your help can't, ain't, your help is not always needed. Sometimes you gotta learn that God don't want you to always help somebody, gang. You stopping the, the, the punishments they was gonna get. You feel me? Sometimes, yeah, yeah, some of y'all didn't know that. Yeah, if you interfere with the punishment he got for them, you getting partial of it. Y'all better go back and study. I got to do my studies too, I ain't gonna lie. And studies, you can't beat, can't nothing beat studies. Can't nothing beat me studying that book right there, gang. Who gonna outdo or out tell me something that that book can't? Nobody. That's why I choose not to listen to no one. I listen to God first, gang. Definitely now, Mary, he said, put him first. Me, then my wife and my family and everything else after. He never said put him first, my mom, my dad. My no, nigga. If you read that motherfucking book, it says once you're one, you join this one, it's you or it's him first. It's him first. Then yourself, the man. Then the woman. And then the family. And then everybody else after. He worked in mysterious ways. That man called. So it's like this, though. We got to apply that same message and that same oomph that he telling us. We got to apply that shit to us. I just learned that though, like, you can you can be reading like a motherfucker, but if you ain't applying it to you, what good is it, right? Right. What good is it? So, you know, with that being said, I just came on to drop that juice for y'all. I know I ain't drop on the weekend. I had some shit on the weekend, but this has been a wild weekend. So, you know, I'm back on square one back at Monday, man, and hopefully everything is everything. Hopefully y'all best. I mean, y'all blessed by the best. And hit that like button too, man. Hit that subscribe button. It's merch. Hit that shit. Hit that like button. Like I said, I got a lot of y'all who watch my shit. Just get up to watch it. Don't even hit that like button. You don't hit the share. Thank you, motherfucker, for watching it. Anyway, I got your view. But bitch ass nigga, hit that like button or something. Damn. I hate a motherfucker like that, dog. That's not that's that sucker shit. Get your sucker ass off my channel. You ain't gonna like. It. Anyway, man, I'm out, man, to the next video.